This is tip number one in how to keep your marriage spicy, not icy. Tip number one is how to keep your romance alive. That's right. So how do you keep the romance alive, Al? Well, I think you have to really think about what you would do when you were dating originally. Yeah. How do I make a special day uh, that the other person would really appreciate? That's true. I also like to flirt. So I just like to look at you and give you eyes. And it works. Does it? Oh yeah. Yeah. Sometimes even uh, going, you know what? We're gonna go to a hotel for the evening. Make it sort of romantic and go for a nice meal that you both enjoy. And I also really like holding hands or touch and having that affection. Um, or you rub my feet or my back or play with my hair all of that touch and i'm not a touch person but there are certain words that you can say that will warm my heart you used to call someone an affectionate name it's still nice and i remember saying to you before like you don't have a name for me all you call me is what sonia <laughs> yeah <laughs> and i said you just call me sonia like you don't have like a nickname for me or anything and i call you my love or whatever yes but I asked you why, and do you remember what you said? No. You said, well, I really, really like your name, so that's why I use it. That's right, I do like Sonia. And that's so that was good enough for me. I thought that that was really sweet. And comment, how do you keep your marriage spicy and not icy?